All right. This is my 76 F-150 Ranger XLT. Uh, I bought it from the original owner's son. His dad had passed away in the late 90s and uh, he kept it under a carport, under a tarp since then. Uh, no doubt it was his dad's pride and joy as he told me time and time again. Uh, he bought it in 76 at Ford in Tucson. It's a factory AC Ranger XLT and uh, had it painted then in 78. I have pictures and everything else of the truck exactly as is uh, getting painted from 1976. And it is just unbelievable. I, I, it's, the, it's the best survivor paint job I've ever seen. The detail, the paneling, uh, everybody thinks it was painted less than a year ago. It just looks too good to be true. Um, and it really, it is. It's a, for, for it being almost 43 years old, the paint is just unbelievable. He had some different wheels on there. So I went ahead and went it back to slot mags, um, which is what his dad had on it when he owned it. And just some BFG raised white letters. I figured that was the right way to go with this thing. Interior is extremely clean for an Arizona truck, not a crack in the dash. Uh, I don't have a radio in it right now. He definitely had like, you know, his little, uh, velvet seat going on here the guy had style for days and uh his son told me they would take it around all the car shows in tucson and phoenix and out to southern california every now and then uh, and he had a camper on the back for a while the bed is extremely clean as well and uh he said they had a lot of good times in this truck and it shows it, it definitely was someone's pride and joy so i've just kind of got it back up and running because it was sitting for so long uh went through did a, a tune-up cleaned out the radiator flushed that rotted the radiator and everything else uh, obviously being arizona it's plenty hot out here the bump the right rear bumper kind of hangs a little low looks like at one point maybe that got hit it just wasn't enough for me to really bother with it and there's one other spot where it looks like it had maybe a, a tire blowout or something like that at one point right here under the trim but other than that the paint is just spectacular um so i've just got it back up and running and um like i said still needs a stereo has a little oil leak on the passenger side valve cover that's going right onto the uh, exhaust coming out so it smokes a little bit off of that need to get around to doing that all small little things overall the truck has a 460 in it um, with a C6 transmission and it runs really well. I just Gets a little hot, but once again, I'm in Arizona So I, I probably if I were to keep it would do a, a radiator and a water pump as well Motor is overall very very clean the big 460. I mean his dad went all out when he got this truck factory AC um, Transmission and everything else seems great brakes are all brand new all the way around But uh, overall, just a really amazing survivor show truck from the late 70s. Not, everybody says, oh, Arizona, no rust, no rust. You know, this truly is zero rust. There is no rust on this truck anywhere. Um, the underside is as clean as the above. It really is spotless. He put some uh, cherry bomb exhaust on there, which actually sound pretty good with the 460. Um, but overall, it is very, very clean. And like I said, I did new brakes front and rear and uh, just got it running again and everything else. It's been really neat to own this, but we're looking at trying to buy some property in another area right now. So that's why I'm putting this thing up for sale. 1976 Ranger. F-150 XLT, factory AC truck, one owner previous, uh, which is the greatest paint in the world. If you have any other questions, uh, hit me up and uh, be happy to take any videos and photos you want of the truck. It is for sale in Tucson, Arizona. 
So feel free to uh, contact me if you need more information.